I'm Jane Gallagher, and I'm from Fox River Valley Pony Michael Club. I'm Wittenberg, and I'm part of the Friends and Alumni Group for the Fox River Valley Pony Club. I'm Colin Gallagher from Fox River Valley Pony Club. My name is Kenzie Wittenberg, and I'm part of the Friends and Alumni Group for Fox River Valley Pony Club. Hi guys, the first craft we're making today is a wheelbarrow for your briar. For this craft you'll need toothpicks, hot glue, cardboard, scissors, and a pencil. To start this craft, draw a square on your cardboard. This is going to be the bottom of your wheelbarrow. Now what you're gonna do is with, when you're cutting the corners, with two of them, it will be slanted like this. And that'll be with this one and this one. And the other two will just be cut normally. Now that these are all cut, bend them and glue them together. So now I finished doing it and if you can see where it slants up, that's bigger than when it's just straight up over here. And so I have this now. So now what you're gonna do is get a couple toothpicks ready and you're going to put a strip of hot glue along the edge and you're going to take one and you're going to put it in all the way until the point is at the very end then you're going to take the other one and put it right beside it and do the same thing on the other side i finished putting them on so this is what it should look like now what you're going to do is draw a circle this is going to be your wheel so draw your circle and cut it out. You're gonna wanna make it as circular as you can so that it'll turn. So now what you're gonna do is use your toothpick and poke a hole in the middle. Move it around until it's easy to turn. Then you're gonna clip off most of the end. And you're gonna glue it on right here. When you've done that, cut off the excess. So now that I've put the wheel on, you can see that it moves around a lot. So what you're gonna do is take some hot glue and make sure you don't, don't touch the wheel, but put some on right here. And once this is dry, I'm gonna move it this as close to that as possible and then get on the other side. I put this on, and so now you can see the wheel barely moves. So now what you're gonna do is cut another toothpick and cut both of them the same size. And then you're going to glue it right here. If it's too big, then you can trim it down after you glue it because you don't want it to be like that. You want it to be more like that. I finished this, so now would be the time for you to paint it. And then when you're done with that, you can take some glue and you can put it along the edge. This will make it more rubber and it'll give it a little bit more friction. And there you have it, a wheelbarrow for your briar. The second craft we're making is a manure bucket. For this craft you'll need hot glue, twine, a ruler, a pencil, scissors, and some cardboard. To start this craft, measure out two inches on your cardboard.
and then line it up and create a line. Then you're gonna cut it out. Now what you're gonna do is take your cardboard and bend it so that it's nice and flexible. When you've done that, you can circle it around into the shape that you want your bucket to be. Now that I've finished putting it together, I'm going to now take another piece of cardboard and I'm gonna trace the bottom onto it. And cut it out. Now that I've cut it out, I'm gonna use some hot glue, put it along the bottom, and I'm gonna stick this on. Now I'm gonna let it cool. It's all dry now, so now I'm going to take some thread, cut it, and I'm going to glue one end onto it. Then loop it around. And after pressing that in for a minute, I'm gonna loop it around and glue it there. I'm gonna do the same on the other side. And there you have it, a manure bucket for your briar. Thanks for watching.